Welcome back to Facebook Monetization. And in this video, we are going to be talking about doing a support site for your membership. And this is a pretty simple process, but it is a necessary one. And it's an underrated aspect of the success of your membership site. And you want to make sure that you're offering support and that that support is available whenever your members need it. And of course, because they're on Facebook, um, you don't want to have you want to, to, to handle your support by answering, uh, let's say, post to your Facebook page. Um, people's instinct will be to do that. Uh, but what it tends to do is to breed negativity and complaining. And so you want to make sure that you establish very early, establish often that if people have support requests and they need things that they should contact your support people um, through your either your support email address or through your support site. Now, what you want to do is to is to go to your your hosting area. Um, any hosting area that has cPanel has what's called an OS Ticket free system, and you can actually set up OS Ticket very easily inside of cPanel. When you're inside of your cPanel hosting account, what you want to do is you'll want to scroll down to the Fantastico area. And in the customer relationship area, you'll want to click on the OS ticket link that you'll see right here. That's going to bring up this page. And all you need to do is then to click this new installation button. And then you'll need to set up OS ticket in order to be your support site. Now what this will do is will allow you to implement a ticket system and to be able to handle, have someone else handle the tickets which will be your outsourcer. And when you have a site you can have multiple people and you can actually have your outsourcer assign tickets over to you. Or you can have multiple people handle support if you want to, if you need to. So that is really why you do want to go one step beyond having a support email address. You want to go ahead and have a support site so that when someone works on a particular ticket, works on a particular situation, you can go back and see the record. And you can actually assign that to someone else who can actually do the work of support. But the, the, the main thing is you want to have support available to people 24 hours a day, seven days a week, so that they can always reach out to you and let you know that there's a problem and you want to pretty much try to solve that problem within 24 hours. If you can, you want to acknowledge the ticket almost the same minute and acknowledge it again that you're working on it. And then go ahead and make sure to go ahead and then get the problem solved within 24 hours. Okay, so with that, thanks and I will see you in another video.